folks, one of the latest crazes sweeping the food industry is having a secret menu. Right, like how you can actually get all the griddle scrapings put into a sandwich if you don't even ask and just find the bucket behind the diner. <laughs> Not exactly. What we're talking about is stuff like in and outs animal style menu, the McGangbang, or the Chipotle Quesarito. Quesarito? McGangbang? Oh, gosh, Sully, this is already getting too Spanish for my taste. <laughs> I don't think... Please welcome food expert Harry Snyder, everyone. Harry Snyder. Thank you for having me on and being able to promote my uh, new restaurant. We call it... Shh. I can... I can see that getting very annoying. Um, so, Perry, tell us more about this secret menu. Well, I can't do that, Michelle. That would give away the whole mystery of shh. Yeah, Sully, it's kind of confidential, like Chick-fil-A's dipping sauce or how Ronald McDonald bleaches his skin. OK, then, Harry. What kind of food does your restaurant normally sell? Whoa, 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 my guy. We can't just go around telling the whole world these things willy-nilly. I can't tell you the, what we sell, because that's the whole point. It's not that we feature a secret menu, it's that we only have a secret menu. I'll serve you the food, but you have to guess it first. And if you get it wrong, back of the line you go. <laughs> it's central to the shh brand. We do the same thing for our food truck. Quiet down! And uh, <laughs> pop up market stand. I'll cut you, snitch! <laughs> so you're saying out of all the foods in the world, we have to try and guess what you might sell at your restaurant. How do you make a profit running this business? <laughs> My dad sells overpriced prescription drugs. Oh, I see. Okay, fine. Give me a shot at this whole secret menu thing. All right, sure. Hi there, beloved customer. What will you be having today? Here's a look at our menu. Uh, well, uh, this is cute. Um, do you have any roasted cauliflower? Ooh, sorry, no good. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, then. <laughs> well, what about the uh, fish? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, but actually, what I was thinking is, I really thanks wanted to. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> Hello, ma'am. What will you be having today? Oh, okay. Think. Think, Sully Bear. Think. <laughs> oh, I'll do my favorite food. Uh, can I get a basket of vinegar-flavored apple seeds? <laughs> uh, sorry, not today, ma'am. Thanks for stopping by. Chat, but... Thanks for stopping by. Oh, okay. Hello, sir. Oh, hi. <laughs> hey. Um, what will you be having today? A hamburger. Mm, no. Thanks for stopping by. Okay. <laughs> Hello, ma'am. Got any acorn tops? Ah, uh, thanks for stopping by. <laughs> sandwiches. Any type of sandwiches. Uh, mm, thanks for stopping by. Oh, what about twigs? Ah, uh, thanks for stopping by. <gasps> Ham? Nah, thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> Little eggs that you could find nested high up in the trees. Mm, no, thanks for stopping by. <sighs> Sully, why do you have the diet of a blue jay? I don't tell you how to live. <laughs> okay, water. Surely you have water. Thanks for stopping by. Ugh. I don't even want to go here anymore. For the love of God, please just tell us what you sell. So you know everything you just said? That, but keto. <laughs> uh. <sighs> well. <sighs> Thanks for stopping by, you two. Uh, look out for us at our next secret location. The answer will be on the next episode of Delish. <laughs> All right. Bye. See you later. Thanks for stopping by.